And you get an idea of the kind of talent you have around you right now. Okay. You look around, I mean, you got guys flying around, catching balls, making plays on both sides of the ball. You got uh, a lot of guys that like turtles. Uh, <laughs> you got, I mean, just all around, you got the talent. You can say, you just got to go out here and win ball games. You got to, we got to keep building every day, uh, and take it one day at a time, like I said, and you know, just trust the system. It's going to be, it's going to be long, early mornings, you know. Long training camp, but I'm looking forward to it. Hey, what does what uh, an offensive line got to do to get Frank Gore going? Nothing. Frank Gore runs on his own motor. He always has for how many ever years he's been playing. He's 35 years old, and he looks like he's 21. So pretty good for a guy that had two bum knees out of college. You got your coach out here in a, in a boot with a broken leg. How does that affect you guys practicing, and what does that say about your coach being out here? He sets the injury? tone. He sets the tone and washes the man. He, uh, you know, he – he actually called me when it happened, I guess, or a few days after, and, and I wouldn't expect anything less of him. Uh, I knew he'd be right here. Uh, he, this is how these NFL coaches are dialed in. That's how they're programmed. They're not going to miss anything. And, uh, you know, yeah, it sets the tone for us as an offensive line, and nothing but respect for that. Is he jet skiing or something? <laughs> no, I don't think it's jet skiing. I think uh, I think got a little traffic accident. Somebody hit him. He, uh, he, he lit a juggle, so he gets a ride around in that little ball. I mean, it would be nice when the sun's out and there's no clouds, but uh, yeah, he's, he's enjoying it. And plus, his son's able to ride around and hear all the cuss words that his dad says. So it's pretty cool. It's a good thing for him. Is there sort of a phrase or a motto or a theme that Coach Wash just constantly says, constantly talks about with the group? Uh, as far as a theme, well, the team theme is Forge right now. And Wash is not a big grind guy. He doesn't like the word grind, so don't say it to him. He's He's more of like come in, do your shit, get your job done, and get out and take care of yourself. Um, Wash, I mean, I don't know. There's not a thing with him. What does forge mean? Forge. Uh, what does it mean? I guess another word for grind. <laughs> come and <in>, come <laughs> Is there anything you guys as a unit did for a little more cohesion during the summertime? Uh, as far as cohesion in the off season, I mean, we group text. I mean, there's guys that. <laughs> All around the states, there's a few guys that stayed here and worked together, um, trained a little bit together. For me personally, I went back to Tennessee with my wife. Uh, we're expecting, so I had to follow their duties to take care of. And uh, you know, we, we did a lot this off season. You know, whether getting to dinner together or going to Top Golf or spending time, uh, we did a lot this off season. And I'm sure we'll get into more of that this season. Did you get anything? Did you get it? I'm sorry. Alan. Did you get anything for your quarterback for his, his uh, 30th birthday? Uh, so Kenny told me today that his birthday is today. I think he turns 30. And so um, I don't know. I might have to throw him in the cold tub or something. I don't know. I didn't, I didn't get him anything. The baby's due September 11th. So it's two days after the first game. Hopefully he'll come before. But first, first. Not, not finding out what the sex is either. So it's a total surprise.